Andrew, how do you create a cohesive digital experience throughout a webinar series? So this is a really good question. And I think that the core of the answer depends on what your content is, which in turn depends on who are your buyer personas. Um, so I'll just, what I'll do is I'll maybe go through a couple of tactics that I've seen used really well. And so one, one of those tactics is that you have a series of topics that are conceptually linked. And this, so in the telestroke world or in the telehealth world, we used to have different topics related to best practices in telestroke. They might focus on some leading edge research. They might focus on particular metrics. Uh, they might focus on techniques from effective hospitals, but, but ultimately users can tune in for some level, some up-leveling of their expertise throughout the series. Active Campaign is doing a good one right now on This Just Works. Mm. So another good, another good uh, tactic for a cohesive digital experience is the practicum format with good follow-up materials. So just think about a great lecture you maybe had in college and then the homework you have to do and the follow-ups they provide you with to help reinforce the materials. I think consistency and format is also really helpful. That's not to say that marketers shouldn't be flexible in you know, testing, say, a live chat feature during a webcast or panels versus individual presenters. Um, but it is important to have that consistency so that people come to associate you with, uh, with high quality content. Uh, then, you know, anytime you can take some sort of messaging that connects the content of your webinar with actionable guidance and the key value propositions of whatever product or service that you, that you offer. Mm -hmm. And so this, this kind of comes down, I have a real simple formulation on thought leadership. Um, it might not work for some people, but for me, it boils down to good advice that people can follow without buying your products but that is made more actionable if they buy your product. Mm -hmm. And so that that's kind of at the heart of trying to create a cohesive digital experience, in my opinion. Oh, great. Thanks so much for that info, Andrew.